Hey everyone, good morning to you. This is a beautiful Sunday morning in Toronto and uh, just a little bit disappointed. I was hoping to visit the St. Lawrence Market uh, on a Sunday and believe it or not, they close on Sunday. And anyhow, I'm just gonna explore the city and with the St. Lawrence Market being closed, uh, I'm not gonna get down about that because I heard there was a really, really nice buffet or Sunday brunch buffet in Toronto and they've been closed for the longest time and it's only recently uh, that they were able to start up again so I can't wait to give it a try. I think it's called the Hot House uh, restaurant and their buffet should be pretty spectacular uh, and it's only $35 so I can't wait. Uh, what a nice way to uh, spend an afternoon or a morning with the market being closed. We get to eat together. Uh, come on, I think it's just coming right up ahead. Come on, let's go in. Hey, Katrin. Hey, Ariana. How are you? Good. How are you? Oh, a little hungry? Oh, yeah. uh, and I heard the buffet is back? Oh, yeah. We All right. Buffet. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Um, can I get a table, please? Of course you can. Oh. Just for one? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Thank you. 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 Uh, really great people and it's really nice to see the buffets are being uh, are coming back. The Hot House has a really really nice buffet but uh, they were down or closed down just until a couple of months ago but uh, really glad to see it starting up again uh, but it looks a little small. I saw the nice meats but uh, just a bit small but that's okay uh, and before we start I think I just need a cup of coffee. Cheers to you. Oh, much needed and I think with that uh, we'll check out the buffet. I hope there's more. It looks uh, a little bit uh, limited but let's go check it out. It's pretty cool getting pretty busy here. All right my concerns are alleviated because uh, I think that's just the omelet and carvery station. Someone mentioned that the real buffet or the main buffet is all the way to the back and uh, let's take a look. Yes, all the busy folks here. Okay. Oh. And we see the bread station. Oh, oh no problem. Really nice bread here, but I think we'll give it a skip because I see some really good items up ahead. So many stations all around. So this is looking pretty good. We've got some greens, some beets. Quinoa, hey there. And my favorite type of salad, potato. Some Greek salad. And I think those are beef noodles. Oh, looks very nice. I think I might have overdid it. Some veggies behind glass. Salami and olives. Ooh, artichokes. A little bit of cheese and a wonderful salmon. Get a big chunk here. So I know it's a buffet and you can uh, get whatever you want, but the uh, portions are, are pretty big. And our tables of stations of food. All right, I think I'm just going to start at the end. Okay. Nothing starts the morning better than some scrambled eggs. Their serving spoons are quite big. So the portions are getting bigger and bigger. What's coming up is the best looking French toast I've seen. A little bit of pecans, some cranberry. Let's see, and a big slice here. And then the staples, the sausages, breakfast sausages, and I think a slice of bacon or three. So stations two and three are coming up. Hi there. So we get to the more of the hearty hot food. We've got some uh, vegetarian stir fry, but this is looking wonderfully cheesy and saucy. This is a cheese capelletti. A little bit of colorful potatoes. Uh, and against the wall, we have more. A nice lasagna. And man, their portions are... Uh, very uh, hearty. All 
All right, there we go. For breakfast, a little bit of shashuka. Oh. Oh, and look at this big, massive pile of mussels. And I think with this, we'll need a bowl. And a little bit of barbecue chicken and some rice. All right, so it's always nice to come back to your table and find something here. We have a nice mimosa. Cheers to you. Mm. Oh, very nice. So I can't wait to get started. So I got uh, quite a few plates here and their portions. I know you control the portions, but uh, their serving spoons and uh, the way they cut them up cut up the food are are quite large and uh it's really nice uh, to see so we've got this wonderful french toast or regular breakfast items and i went back for the uh, salmon it's kind of nice every time you uh, pass by the buffet for the second time you find something new the mussels and that wonderful uh hot dishes here and this is looking like a tortellini instead all right i can't wait to dig into the beef noodles Oh, nice and soft. I think a bit of beef here. Mm. Very nice. The noodles are nice and saucy. Lots of meat and uh, very refreshing. Mm. Can't wait to try the potato salad with the salmon. Mm. right on the potato salad. Sandwiched in between. Mm. I think that's my favorite combination. The creaminess of the potato salad with the smoky saltiness of the smoked salmon. Perfect combination. Mm. Very good. A little bit of mimosa. Mm. And I can't wait to try the hot food items. I'll give the uh, lasagna a try. That looks really good. Oh. And the nice part is that I got the end piece. A little bit of that. Mm. What a lasagna should be. Very tasty. And uh, meaty and creamy at the same time. Perfectly baked. Mm. I gotta try that French toast and maybe a little bit of bacon. Pile it high. Try not to get anything tipped over. Mm. It's like a balancing act, but that French toast is just so custardy. A little bit of crunch from the pecans and the smoky crispiness of the bacon. Mm. Make sure you get their French toast. Usually I skip it. So glad I did not skip it this time. So I'm going to continue finishing off this first course. And then going to check out that wonderful Barbary station. And that wonderful omelette station. And I'll see you in a bit. Cheers to you. Very good. Oh. One last piece to finish the first round. Really good. That shashuka, really fantastic. That egg yolk was nice and jammy. I think I'm gonna head out and check out what they have at the carvery station. Maybe get an omelet or two. Come on, let's go. Really nice to see it dying down. 
Hey, Asan, how are you? How are you? Not too bad. Keeping busy? Yeah. Oh, really busy. Can I get a yeah? Can I get an omelet, please? Uh, maybe some uh, ham and bacon and uh, tomatoes. Yeah. You got some caramelized onions. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Aksan. Oh, thank you. Hey, Buj, how are you? How are you? Very good. And uh, you have a wonderful carving station? Yeah. Can I get some of that? Is that a turkey? This is ham. Oh, this is ham. Oh, with all the cloves. It smells really nice. This tight, too. All right. And for the beef, can I get a fatty cut if you have one? Thank you so much. Very nice. Thank you. All right, wonderful omelet here and lots of meats. And do you know what would make an omelet better? Smoked salmon. So no smoked salmon, but poached salmon is just as good. Oh, always a massive chunk right on top. All right, round number two. And it's certainly getting lively. In fact, uh, passing by, you see the live bands here, nice jazz and uh, really cool stuff. And it's really nice to see things lively again. Many glasses of mimosas. Time to dig into the omelet. Move the hams and the meats around. A little bit of uh, poached salmon. Oh, wonderful. Mm. Very nice. So fantastic cheesy omelet with a juicy tomato and the sweetness of the poached salmon and a salty kick of the ham. Mm. Very good. Digging into the roast beef next. Oh, just falling apart with a butter knife. Very good. Nice and beefy. Uh, not like a prime rib. A uh, little bit of a chew to it and very good. Mm. So definitely going to finish this up quickly because when I was getting the buffet, I took a peek at the desserts, particularly the ice cream bar. And uh, I think I need to make sure I'm in time for that. So I'll take you back. Oh, just in time. I think uh, the dessert station is getting way busy. Wow. Very colorful. All right. So I'm going to skip these ones. These ones here. So we've got the right plate for the right job. And uh, let's see what we have. Some nice waffles. I should have got those at the beginning. And the cho Ooh, chocolate syrup. Hey, Sri. Hey, Sabiha. Oh, really nice job on the waffles. They look terrific. Can I get some cake here? You got so many. We have different types of cake. Oh, banana chocolate. Banana chocolate? Yeah. It's a creme brulee. Creme brulee cheesecake. Yeah, it's cheesecake as well. Oh, and the... Vanilla project cake. Oh, a colorful cake. This is a brownie cheesecake. Yeah. And we have vegan chocolate cake as well. Oh. Some chocolate cream brulee as well. Yeah, you just grab the plate. Oh, alright. That chocolate cake looks really good, but it's got bananas in it. Uh, yeah, there's bananas. Huh, let's give that a try. Yeah. Oh, you know, banana's not my favorite, but this looks really good. And I don't think I can say no to that colorful piece of birthday cake. You? Oh, that's plenty. <laughs> what better with cake than uh, ice cream? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks again, Shemiha. What yeah. do you have? I have vanilla, yeah. cookies and cream, uh -huh. coconut, and strawberry sorbet. Oh, nice. Can I get some uh, coconut? Yeah, can I get some coconut, please? 
sure. You pick the right one. All right. So clever. This is the first scoop. Oh, nice. The lucky first scoop. In a separate plate. Perfect. The third and final round. And unfortunately, three rounds is all I can do. But really nice desserts from Shamiha and Shri. And I'm missing out on the waffles, but that's okay. Uh, let's try the banana chocolate cake. But uh, banana is not my favorite, but let's see how it is in cake form. Oh, a little bit of the middle here. Mm. If you like banana, you'll love this. It's a really moist banana cake and the flavor is intense. And if you like it, definitely go for it. But I'm so glad I got the birthday cake. And what's better with birthday cake than with ice cream? Let's go for some of that. Nice spoonful of the coconut ice cream with a base of birthday cake. All right, and if it's your birthday, happy birthday to you. Oh, happy birthday, Rishad. Cheers to you. Mm. Really good. And got to try the chocolate creme brulee. Oh. Oh. Velvety smooth. And again, one of the Asian compliments. Not too sweet, but a really deep, uh, caramelized, nutty, chocolatey flavor. Mm, very good. So, really nice to see everything kind of getting back to normal. This is the hot house right by uh, St. Lawrence Market. And uh, really nice to explore there. And uh, I was just by the bar and I saw glasses and glasses and glasses of champagne and orange juice. They were saying they go through 40, 50 bottles a day. So really nice to hear. And with that, um, I'm going to enjoy my dessert cookies and the coffee. Mm. Very nice. And with that, I hope you're eating well and I hope you're keeping well. Until we see each other again, take care and God bless. All the best to you. Cheers.